The self-organization skill is one of the unique abilities of army ants. This skill helps them to find food and return to their nest. However, sometimes a small change occurs, typically caused by an environmental trigger, which leads to the formation of an ant meal, often referred to as an ant death spiral. This is known as an ant mill, an unsettling phenomenon where army ants march in a spiral. Ants are social insects which form small to large colonies. The biggest colony discovered is a super colony of Argentine ants in Europe, which have a few billion workers. This colossal and complex city was created by the collective will of the ant colony, the super organism. A typical colony contains two or three queens, limiting the initial brood to less than 100 eggs and lots of adult workers together with their brood. But these 10 queens have produced well over 300 eggs. And when they hatch, the colony will become an instant superpower. Workers are the most ants in the nest. They have poor eyesight and lack permanent nesting sites. They build and protect nests, find food, take care of the brood and the queen. Even though all workers are female, they are sterile and do not lay eggs. Queen with wings are only in the nest for a short time. And right after they come out, they leave to mate and make new nests. Queens are mostly like workers but have bigger bodies. In some kinds, queen with wings are not present and Regular workers or ants in between queens and workers, known as agatoid queens, play the eggs. This is the, the queen of the colony, and I'm going to very carefully pick her up. She's surrounded by attendant workers who are biting me now. Ow! Ants have specific jobs in their group, and what they do can change as they get older. When they're young, they take care of eggs and baby ants. As they grow up, they might start building and digging. Later on, they become food getters, leaving the nest to find food. Every ant group has its own smell, and ants use the smells or pheromones to know who belongs to the nest and who doesn't. They can tell if another ant is from a different colony or if it's a friend. The ants moving down here are laying behind them a chemical pheromone trail that marks the way for other ants. When ants look for food or explore, they leave a scent behind using pheromones. This smell helps other ants from the same nest find the food or new places. If an ant finds danger of food, it can release special smells to tell the other ants about it. And successful, resistant laws for making parties to lead larger groups back to food. But when things go wrong, it leads to a deadly phenomenon, the ant mill. The first ant milling that scientists discovered was in 1936, when disease Snerla saw hundreds of ants circling for a whole day, even in heavy rain. By the next day, most of them were dead, and a few were barely moving in circles. He also noticed that the ant species still alive took advantage of the dead ants by carrying them away. The main reason why ants have to keep the waste and the dead remains of ants out of the way of the colony is that when you're in such high abundances in the colony, you don't want any diseases to spread, and so you have to maintain your environment. It has to be clean. The biggest ant mill observed was hundreds of feet across, but most are smaller just a few inches or a few across with a few dozen ants. Insect photographer Alex Wilde mentioned seeing these spirals often. He noticed that while it's deadly for individual ants, it doesn't really harm the whole colony, which could have hundreds of thousands of ants. We're exploring if there are other animals that do something like the ant meal. It turns out there is! Some species like caterpillars, bats, amphibians, dogs, and fish also have a circular behavior. This protect behavior helps them in different ways. For many, it's about giving them protection against predators and increased feeding efficiency. 